Greetings and welcome back to Besiege. Yeah, let's dive right in to the island of Ypsilon, the only island we can play so far. And last time we actually did a lot of work. So we made our way through that battlefield. We tore down that wall and burned up a whole village. We ripped off an entire army and we did some forklifting um, at the old mining site. So I think next is the standing stone in so zone 7. So let's go ahead and see what this level has got in store for us. So, um, we need to destroy that stone. Okay, so I think the basic principle of the machine stays the same thing. I just have to aim higher. So we have to build a bigger machine. Um, no, I don't want to destroy it yet. I want to uh, actually save that machine. Past us single cannon. I know that's not uh, the correct, cor correct pronunciation, but uh, yeah, it shall fit in the box. Okay, so um, as I said, the basic machine layout was uh, very good. It was quite all right. And I want to keep that. But right now I need uh, more firepower. And yeah, I think more stability. So I have to do some braces right here. And now we have to build the actual cannon tower. So intersection. Oh. Let's do it like this then. I think that should be all right now. Yeah. So, now, as I said in the last episode, um, yeah, let's make it terrible first. Um, the most important thing when you have a force going in one direction is to actually um, be able to, um, to withhold that force. So, um, as an example, I want to play some cannons here and show you what I mean with that. So, I will put five cannons right here, right on that single wooden branch, without any um, help for structure. First of all, you see um, there's quite a heavy load on that branch, and it went down. And now, if I shoot, it will... Uh, go back quite a bit. Um, I'm very happy that it didn't break, but it didn't hit the stone either. So, I have to actually go ahead, delete all these, and place another block like that. So, uh, yeah. This thing will become more ridiculous right away. <laughs> and... I don't know if the firepower will be enough, so let me do this. As I said, this thing will get uh, more and more ridiculous right away, so don't uh, don't be concerned. Um, ridiculous level over 9000, I guess. Um, yeah, let's let me re delete these. Um, yeah, like some. Okay, again. Um, yeah, like that. Structural integrity. Right. So, let's put some cannons on there and show you how bad this whole thing can be. Okay, I think uh, that thing will, will break without any help. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, it's quite top heavy. Oh, God, that thing looks ridiculous. <laughs> What happens if I move? Oh god! <laughs> oh! Ooh! Yeah, that is what I meant by we need to improve structural integrity. And interestingly enough, that thing shoots at us and burns our machine. Right, we need to get a little bit nearer. And we 
we definitely need some uh, some better stability. So, um, right, let me do this like that. Over engineering for the win. Okay, I need to connect these with that, these with that, that thing. Mm -hmm. I can't connect it with anything, um, so let's undo that last move. Okay, um, ah, sure, why not? Let's let's do this just for good measure. And yeah, let's try that again. And there we go. Um, unfortunately, our machine tipped. And I don't like that. Uh, but we destroyed the stone. Um, although we burned to death. So I consider that a very successful um, demonstration of how these straps can improve our machine. Well, let's go to the next zone. <laughs> okay, so oh, we have to use explosive to de uh, explosives to destroy that thing. Hmm. So I think by explosives they uh, they mean a bomb. Oh, can we use the cannon? Let's let's try that. Well, that didn't work at all. At least that whole thing stayed safe, but. Yeah, it, it will tip over. So, how can I place a bomb properly, I guess? So, yeah, I have to destroy that machine again. Uh, ah, let's save it first. It's, it's such a nice little pastas. Uh, how shall we call that? Overpowered... Or well, let's call it Pastor's Top Heavy. Okay, there we go. That's a nice name, I guess. Destroy. Okay, so... I think what we can go here... Or for what we can go here is... Pretty basic. As we just need some... Ex oh, I want to undo that. We just need some explosives. That is pre pretty easy. Um, I don't know, how many of you play Company of Heroes or something like that? Um, the Germans in World War II used a thing called Goliath, which was pretty much a small tank filled with explosives, and yeah, that was pretty much it. They drove it behind enemy lines, and, well, exploded it. So I think you can guess what I want to do here, right? Set it to the ground. Explodes on impact. Well. <laughs> I am way too happy when explosions happen. Wow. Um, ah, there we are. Okay. That didn't go too well, now did it? Okay, so, um... We need to have a fitting, a proper fitting for them, so I guess let's do it like this then. Can I... yeah, that's better. That's what I need. So... Yeah. Let's do it like this then. So... Boom! Yes! And how much did we destroy? I have no idea, but I think we were pretty successful. That thing blew up. Nice. I like that. I really like that. Um, okay, let's go to the next zone. Destroy 90% of everything. Knights, tents and cannons. Moo ha ha. Wow. Um... That was pretty radical, I guess. How about, since um, I, I don't think explosives will help right here, we need something more stable. So, 
Um, how about using some armor for this time? So, like this. We have some front armor. Then I want some braces. Since we will drive through an enemy army. Then I think we can use something nice to to surprise them. So this and that. Ah, why not? Let's don't be too uh, no, that last thing I don't need. Uh, like this. Right, I want to put braces here. You will see in a second why. Um, pretty much because I'm a madman. I don't know, this seems to be pretty much the right game for me. Um, let's use some metal spikes. Boom. Oh, yeah. And that has a nice height for that. And then... Hehehe. <laughs> he. Know what I'm going for? I guess so. Okay, so we've got some nice armor plating right in front of there. And so let's see what we can do here. Well, that didn't went as planned. So let's see if I can go... Hmm. That didn't work too well. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a cannon right there. Interesting. Hmm. Okay, I need to drive through there. Oh, I can still steer, I guess. Hmm. Uh, okay, let us remove these and put some flamethrowers on there. Okay, bummer. How about this then? Two flamethrowers should be enough. We can activate them with Y. And let's go. <laughs> okay, that's a pretty fitting end, I guess. Right, so... Another try? Why not? Mm, no, that didn't work at all. Okay, so... I think... Yeah, we have too many cannons on here. I think we have to place them a bit more strategically. Um. Oh, I wanted a circular saw on the wheels. Oh. Oh well, let's do it like that. It doesn't do anything, but it looks cool. So, beat it. Okay, like this. And now I want a holder. I want a bomb. So that when I get hit and fall, I will explode. Okay. Oh, I like that. I like that. <laughs> Death and despair everywhere. <laughs> it actually worked. It actually worked. I can't believe it. Wow. Um, Death and despair, right. <laughs> cool. So, um, I think that is enough destruction for one episode, so thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this little destruction cycle of mine, and there goes the saw in the distance, still spinning around like a bad man, oh god. Right, <laughs> please leave a rating if you like this video, as it always helps me out. And if you want to see more of this series in particular, or some of my other series, then uh, go ahead, go over to my channel and hit the little subscribe button. I hope to see you next time, so until then, yours faithfully, the best of Aryan.